So the next part of this project is to mount the connector to this block. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and drill and tap some holes for these screws here. So the first thing I'm going to do is put a little bit of layout die on here. And let that dry for a bit. Okay, let that dry for a bit. I'll go ahead and mark this out. And I've got little marks for where it will go. And I'll just get a little center punch for each of these. So I'm putting a 632 screw in each of these holes. So I looked up which drill bit I need to use, and it's a number 36. So I got that all chucked up in my drill press here, and I'll go ahead and drill those out now. Okay, that should do it for filling the holes. Okay, I've got my tap follower and my drill press here, and uh, I got my little tiny 632 tap in there. I'll go ahead and start tapping these holes. I'm going to spot do it. Okay, and that's the last one. Okay, just cleaned off the dicum, and I'll go ahead and screw this on here. Okay, and that's where I ended up today. Got the block pretty much all finished. Got the corner, the corners drilled out and tapped, and I've installed the connector on it. And here's the other side here. So the actual radiating part of the antenna will be coming out of here, and the ground plane elements will be coming out here. 
that's it for now. Thanks for watching.